What's going on guys, Copert here, and welcome to my Terminator Stone Let's Play. This is episode 62, it's nighttime, so some of you are going to be like, what is going on? If you read the chat, you'll see, oh shit, <laughs> and I apologize for the language, but yeah, I think that's it. Uh, we, I've been watching a spider all night, I've been kind of monitoring it, trying to get other things done, um, and I just, it, it's kind of been walking away from the wall, walking back, kind of doing what uh, matriarchs do, and then while I was overdoing one other thing, um, we got some bad news here. Basically, I mean, I didn't see it happen. It, last I saw it, it was like over here. Like this is where it was hanging out. So for some reason, and, and again, it was, I don't even want to say a minute tops. What I was working on was over here. I'm, I've been working on the gate. I decided to change it a little bit. I wanted to re-up the gates because my engineer is higher now. So I wanted to put new gates in. I'm putting dungeon doors in. So I've been kind of having to reshape everything, which actually I'll just do this right now. Um, no, I actually can't do that. So let's just do, let's send the order and then we'll see what happens. Okay, you can see I've just kind of been reshaping that scaffolding all over. It's, it's a mess. It's kind of a pain in the butt. So I've been doing that a little bit, queuing work there, and then coming over here and sliding over, checking the spider. I don't know what happened. Oh, we got an archer there too. We've had a lot more activity at the door. I wonder if that's because we, excuse me, killed the one necromancer, so now there's like more bad guy bucks to spend. But anyway, what I did was I slid an archer over here to man a guard post just to keep an eye on her. You can see I put uh, campfires here. Let's put some logs on. Put campfires here so I can see. Hopefully you guys can see enough. I'll try to remember to brighten it up. But it looks like she's going to be into the bright area soon anyway. Um, thinking that if, if the spider approached, I would at least get a warning. Now, I didn't. And, and the reason for that, I, I believe, is because she the matriarch had already been spotted. Now, I don't know if that mechanic only works like if it, she's only been spotted by the same exact person or the whole colony as a whole. I, I don't like that mechanic. I think any time a monster approaches should be spotted. Because, um, yeah, here's what happens. Obviously, you can see the little spiderling here. So the, the matriarch must have climbed in somewhere. We, I've seen it do that before. And then climb the wall. Cause, but the thing I don't understand is I have, to some degree, now this is the only thing, this is where we learn here. I have an overhang. But you, you see here, and it looks like by her positioning... She came over right here in this area. I mean, she could have come over over here, I guess. I'm just looking to see if I missed a spot at all. I hope you guys can see this. I'm not sure. My only theory is, unfortunately, because I didn't see it, is that she can go through this little hook right here. You can see there's not... So what I'm going to have to go through now is fill in all these. So that that's interesting. That's something we can learn. If one of you guys can confirm that, let me know. I thought I had an overhang. Apparently, I don't. Spider made it up. I don't see any that I've missed. I'm sure if I'm missing one, you guys will tell me. I don't. She didn't come from this way. If anything, she may have come from further this way, but I don't see it here either, and I'm, I'm pretty sure she didn't swim all the way here, climb up, and, and run down, because that doesn't quite work. But it is a little interesting that the baby spider is all the way over here. So I'm not sure. I really don't know what happens. It's unfortunate. Even though she, uh, my, my archer died, I'd at least like to learn from it. Um, the only thing, like I said, I can theorize right here is that she climbed up and can fit through this little nook here. If one of you guys can confirm that, that'd be great. So, and of that, what the hell do we do now? This is, oh my god, this is literally the worst spot she could have possibly come up. She's got the stairs to easily get right back down. Wouldn't matter, she could climb down, but, um, I have no, this is, this is really bad. I mean, I guess yeah, I have the mind. So what I'm gonna have to do now is all hands on deck. So what we're gonna do... We're going to click. No, I don't want that. I want them. All right. I got the matriarch. She is injured. So it looks like the archer was shooting it, which she wasn't injured before. So what we're going to do then is come in here. If I could ever get a. I don't know why that guy's not working. So let's seek and destroy. Uh, idle. Seek out target. And frost cap. Idle. Seek out target. This is, I mean, there's no, there's no messing around now. What the heck? Come on. I don't seek out that target. Um, I'm going to make you as well. Do you have your, you have no items on you. That's interesting. Um, do I have anybody else like sleeping or anything? I have you. Jets, I need you to wake up. Where are the armors? All right, so you go there, Jets. Archers, wake up. going on oh clickety 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 uh, the joys of this game sometimes it always happens when you need to move efficiently too like why can't i click this guy come on 
Can we add where I can drag and drop and it just highlights the person? I'm probably a little panicked here, if you can't tell. Why am I not able to click this single person? I think I already did click them, but I don't... Oh my gosh, what is going on? Alright, anyway. I'll just see who moves and I'll, move. I'll go again. Let's see. And what I'm going to do is you're going to go idle, seek out target. Idle, seek out target. I want you to get up and get your... Here we go. Idle, see... I, I need everybody to attack is basically what happens. This matriarch could rip us apart right now for sure. Idle, seek out target. Now I have to remember this if I do live through this, which I think I... Oh, you manned that siege engine. Ay, ay, ay. Seek out target. You do have weapons. Yes, okay. Uh, all right, so uh, there's one right here. No? All right, I think he looked like he had armor on. I have to remember that if I do live through this, to set everybody back up on guard positions. Uh, you. Idle. Seek. What do I have up here? I want to have... You're, you're actually fishing up here. Right, I'm going to leave... Uh, I'm not sure what to do here. This one I'm going to remove. And I'm going to put... Military guard position. I'm going to put over the... Over the gate. Oh, gosh. And that's just for archers, so I want someone standing there. I got that. I need someone on the, the main gate still, because I have been having some action there. So this one can go now as well. Idle, seek out, and charge the enemy. So hopefully these guys will be converging. And because what I have to do... Oh, my goodness. I have to basically click all these people. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go here. Just get everybody away. I'll worry about getting them into the tunnel later. I have to check and make sure all this clicking is working. So I'm sure I'm going to miss some people. I'm sure some of it's not going to work. Oh, my goodness. And then we're going to start it up, and we're going to see what the spider does. I can't believe the thing got in. But actually, I guess it adds a little excitement. But like I said, this is... I think I said it at the end of the last episode. This is about the worst place that this spider could have come through for me. All right. Now, what I want to see is what this spider does and what my people do. All right. So, spider's coming down. I kind of hope she doesn't come and kill all the spiders that, or the chickens. That would kind of stink. Yeah, this house does nothing because it has no roof, but I have soldiers converging. Okay. And, yeah. So, what I want to do... I want you to move over here. I can intercept. I know you're going to go for her, too. Yeah, and I, kinda, I can't move everybody, unfortunately. Where's CP? Just getting everybody away. I, I mean, I think the battle is going to be over relatively quickly. One way or the other. Because if, if this spider shreds my defenses, you know, we're kind of, kind of, foobar. And it's just going to rip through the rest of us. Just want to make sure there's no easy pickings for the spider. Alright, it turned around. And it stopped. Look at how fast that thing is, man. It is aggro and something. I'm not sure exactly whom. Okay, do you have arrows? No, you don't have them yet. You don't have arrows yet. What are you folks doing? Alright. Oh, then I might have to sacrifice one. <laughs> um, yeah, you know what? Is he going for him? So what I'm going to do... Sorry, Mr. David Martin. Oh my gosh. Alright, you go this way. You come over this way. Uh, Mr. David Martin, what are you? Level 20 farmer. Pretty sure this one is attacking you, and you're not going to outrun her. So what I'm going to do with you is run you that way. Actually, that way. Okay. So hopefully you can buy us some time. 
Otherwise, what do you got here? Are you are you equipped yet, Juets? Not yet. You're not either. Why are you guys not like set up to go? It would be great if some archers kind of came and helped out. <laughs> Do you have your stuff yet? No. Why? I, I, I really got to pay attention to this sometime. Luton Jr. And you have nothing. I wonder if I should just, in my in, in the inventory, just make them always carry certain things. It doesn't seem to work, but it certainly would be better right now. All right, so you're going to be idle. You're going to seek an attack. You're also going to get up. Don't know that you're going to be able to really help us right now. All the peoples are running. All right, so let's see what happens. Again, I apologize, guys. I hope you can see. Hopefully, he's going to be diversionary. She's walking away. Oh, got a wood chopper here. Oh, God. Come on. Just let me click the things. All right, so as long as I just hold him up a little bit, let's my soldiers, who are walking incredibly slow can get in into an intercept, that'd be great. I don't know if this even works, but I'm gonna give it a whirl. Now those are soldiers. No door on here. But in theory I could I could defend it, I suppose. You are what? Guarding point attacking spider. Alright, so it's it's pathfinding to it. Just they take forever. Hopefully this will get them all down here. And I'm going to just have to keep micromanaging this. All right. My soldiers are moving just very, very slowly. And that... Our, our wood chopper is going to get killed. You don't have an, 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 a bow and arrow. That's a problem. Oh, my God. Why do you guys not equip? Like, I wait, they need to give me a, a command so that I can get them to equip. Steel arrows. You still don't have a sword. Like, pull on, please. Is that, is that on there? But it's not, like, armed. Why are you sitting taking a rest? Alright, you're there. That's good. You are attacking the matriarch, and you have a bow and arrow. Thank you, Jonathan. Thank you. You are going to try to help us out, which I like. Stand there by the tree. Those guys are going... Where is Mr. Luton? Now, the big the, the big concern here is obviously, again, they're not getting food. Eating, okay. I mean, I guess you gotta eat. Uh, you are equipped. You are standing at guard position. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna have you be idle and seek out fame and fortune by being the one that defeats it. I want you to come... Just, just come here and then reassess what you need to do. You, sir, I think I set you to go back over here. Forced move. See, that's what I did wrong. So, idle and seek. All right, your CPR, of course, because you're like the most important character I have, but you're the one that I haven't told to move down here. Oh shoot, I forgot about all these guys sleeping. I think I told her to move, didn't I? Um, CPR. Alright, let's see. Just want to make sure these are all ready to go. All these farmers got to come down here, too. This is probably going to be much, you know, like, not necessary. Like I said. 
if I don't defeat this guy, I think I will. I think I'll get him. All right. It's just gonna be a matter of how much I, how much I lose. Um, beds are down there. Man, it's like a nuclear bunker. So let's see, Mr. David Martin. I'm sorry, dude. You are going to die. She almost should have you attack. You might actually kill him. Actually, I wanna, I'm gonna turn you this way so that hopefully this guy can. Get away. This guy's got to hustle. Man, it, these spiders are so fast. But okay, let's watch the rest. I think David's going to die like, pretty much now. Okay, because he's... Alright, he didn't really move because... I'm not sure. <laughs> Alright, where? You guys are so slow. These guys are... Oh my goodness. I just didn't realize they were that slow. I don't understand. Unless it's something with the pathfinding. He's going to go after the farmer. He'll lose another farmer. Another level 16, okay. So what I'm going to have heard you then is go this way. Now he can take some shots. Are you going to shoot now? Yeah. Alright. So we're not really going to give her... We are going to give her up to some degree, but you can come here. He's probably still going to get there, but hopefully I'll take him away from the art, the chopper. This is someone I don't want to lose. I don't think. Level 19 chopper. Well, a week back. That's not so hot. Hopefully that'll bring them closer to these guys who can intercept. You now have a bow. Okay, so why don't you come there? You are on a forced move. Do you have your gear yet? You're getting it, I guess. Emptying your inventory. I'm not sure why that works that way, but it always kind of has. You come there. Right, we're getting people in position. Um, again, just come in here, please. Again, I hope you guys can see. Oh, come on. What are you doing now? Eating. No, do not eat. This is the thing that drives you nuts. Let's see here. Um, morale. Morale's fine. This is this is what really kind of irks me about this game sometimes. There's a dire threat here. You're going to go eat a meal? The whole morale thing is supposed to work and, and kind of... Uh, am I hitting something wrong? No. Seeking... No, I have it charged. I have it ready to go. Shoot the spider, please. Ah. <sighs> It's like, come on, now where are you going? Sleeping. Sure. Alright, this game needs like a rally call where I could click down here and it makes everybody go military. You know, like, and everybody, all the other needs are kind of put aside. Obviously, I don't want anybody starving to death. I don't want anything like that. But these guys need to not go eat, not go to sleep. You know, you're the defense force. I need you guys to shoot some people and, and kill the spider. Probably take one arrow. That's it. Uh, so this farmer's gonna die, and this guy is so slow. <laughs> I don't know why he's so slow. I mean, because he's in full plate, I guess. Nice. Oh, he's got an arrow into it. Um. Dude, can you... I know, I haven't forced marching, so you get out of here. I don't know how you live... With your excellent kiting skills. Cassandra, we need some help here with Cassandra, please. Oh, Cassandra lives. Whew. Oh my goodness. Cassandra on that shred of health. Oh my gosh, my phone's going crazy. If you only knew what I'm dealing with right now. And Cassandra gets the kill. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Great job. Alright, so we've got some action here too. Right? What is? Oh no no no! Is that? Sure looks like a necromancer. That does not look like. I mean, that's a campfire. What is burning here? Right? That's not. What is that? Oh, it's a flame arrow. Okay, I see it now. Yep. All right, so we've got a flame arrow. All right, so things are ramping up, which, you know, is kind of where I'm like, ah, but it's good. It's what we want. 
Let's just see. Cassandra Steel Halberd hits Spider Matriarch in the chest. Spider Matriarch's bite hits Cassandra in the legs. That's why she kind of lived. It, it didn't hit the main. Cassandra Halberd hits the steel in the chest. Two chest blows. Good job. Nico Stone Tipped Arrow hits Matriarch in the chest. Now, that's probably something I should have done for some of those guys that were like gearing up, is I should have told them to grab some iron arrows or something like that, which I should start making to have on hand, and I should have one guy that just carries, he should be my best archer, he should carry, like, bronze arrows, and that's that's it, because, I mean, I have have enough at this point, and Cassandra Steel Halberd hits the matriarch in the legs for a killing blow, one more hit on Cassandra, she was toast, alright, so, what do we learn here, we learn that, um, I'm still vulnerable, over here, I thought I was scared, I'm gonna have to go through and get all these little nooks, I guess it's the only thing I can think of. I have to turn everybody onto guard position, but I'll do that in a second. And yeah, so I think what I'm gonna do is is I'm gonna now that we had this night episode, which I hate. I'm sorry. Um, I'm gonna then play fast forward all the way through the next day, kind of try to finish this area up, get everything prepped for the bridge. Now, if something pops up again, we get attacked. I'll obviously record that. But I'm gonna do the maintenance on day 62 or. I guess, yeah, this is 62, I think. I'm not exactly sure how it falls. I have to go look. I'm all flustered. Um, everybody's going to have to get back to their jobs now. And get everything prepped up so that the next episode we can actually now start to take the bridge across. You can see things are ramping up big time. I'm going to have to, obviously, I don't need 20 builders making the bridge, which maybe I want, but I, I think it'll be passing night for I need to finish this stuff. I need to secure up because that was like... I was paying attention, but it just shows you, despite paying attention and being aware that an enemy was there, they can still get the drop on you, and a lot of times, that's how you die. That spider kills a couple people that are vital to you, doesn't kill everybody, but kills a couple, maybe kills some of your best archers or defenders, and then next thing you know, the next attack is the one that gets you, so that's kind of, you know, how my, my things have unraveled before, so let's, right now, before I forget, stand at guard, stand at guard, no, I don't want that. Because I don't, I might have, like, the, my, the reason I don't do that, which normally wouldn't be a problem. Um, I don't have, actually, I'm going to have to put patrols back out. So I'll get to that in a second. I'll let those guys um, get to their guard positions and I'll, I'll pick who I want to send out on patrols and, and things like that. Um, I think I have a couple of the skeletons on the other side of the river still marked as, like, charge. So I don't want to have that set up that way. Everybody's standing at guard position for now. I'll let everybody get resorted. And then we'll figure it out from there. I don't have an archer here. I need someone on this door ASAP. Yeah, I'm starting to talk military code because, you know, we just had a battle. <laughs> uh, I need someone up there, too, because we have had some visitors there. What is going on here? I need to build this up. Didn't I do that? I, I'm not sure. I, I got I got little projects everywhere to do. My honeydew list on this on this castle is getting a little crazy. Uh, trying to manage it all up. I need to get this thing built. This nice dungeon door. I wanna. I'm theorizing that the dungeon doors are a little stronger. So what I did was when I spider first showed up, I deleted the old two castle doors because they were made when my engineer was lower skilled, and I put new ones in with level 15 engineer, hoping that would uh, be a little more resilient. I didn't think he could get up here, so I thought he was going to have to come this way and attack through the door or this way and go over, which I thought would be good. I'd get plenty of shots at him, but that's not the case. I even, you can see, I put some, I, I queued up some stuff over here overhang so that um, he couldn't get up this way. You know, obviously we learned a lesson there. So interesting stuff. I'm just going to let the game run a little bit. We learned, we learned, we survived. Uh, who did we lose? We lost uh, David, right? Uh, the farmer? I think that's about it. Where'd he go? He's gonna he's gonna uh, fertilize the farm crop. Oh, we got a little spider here now. Watch this guy. This guy's gonna take out like the, the really the level 20 farmer. No, nope, farmer said, no, get out of here. All right. So, yeah, I'm going to have to kind of figure things out, <laughs> clean up the mess, so to speak. Thank you for watching, guys. That's probably one of the most exciting attacks and episodes we've had in a while here, which says a lot about my, my fortress. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you could see, man. I, I hate that it was at night, but sometimes these things can't be handled any differently. I might just leave the spider there as, like, a monument. Like, I wonder if I could, like, stone block this up. Idle, stand at guard position, take off the seek. 
If I could, like, make this pretty something, just leave the spider there. That would be pretty funny. I'm going gonna, I'm to leave it there for now. I don't need the spider silk. So, uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I will talk to you next time. Take care.